The Girls I've Been by Tess Sharp Part 1 Truth is a Weapon The First 87 Minutes Chapter 1 August 8th, 9.09 a.m. It was supposed to be 20 minutes. That's what I told myself when I woke up that morning. It would be just 20 minutes. We'd meet in the bank parking lot. We'd go in. We'd make the deposit, and it would be awkward. It would be so awkward. But it would be 20 minutes tops. I could survive 20 minutes with my ex-boyfriend and new girlfriend. I could handle the awkwardness. I was a freaking champ. I even got donuts, thinking maybe that would help smooth things over after last night's makeout interrupts, which I know is downplaying what happened. I get fried dough can't fix everything, but still, everyone loves donuts, especially when they have sprinkles. Or bacon. Or both. So I get the donuts. And coffee, because Iris is basically a grizzly bear unless she downs some caffeine in the morning. And of course, that makes me late. By the time I pull up to the bank, they're both already there. Wes is out of his truck, tall and blonde and leaning against the chipped tailgate, the bank envelope with all the cash from last night right next to him. Iris is lounging on the hood of her Volvo in her watercolor dress, her curls swinging as she plays with that lighter she found on the railroad tracks. She's going to set her brush out on fire one of these days. I swear to God. You're late, is the first thing Wes says when I get out of my car. I brought donuts. I hand Iris her coffee, and she hops off the hood. Thanks. Can we just get this over with? He asks. He doesn't even look at the donuts. My stomach clenches. Are we really back to this? How can we be back to this? After everything. I press my lips together, trying not to look too annoyed. Fine. I put the bakery box back in my car. Let's go. I snatch up the envelope from his tailgate. The bank's just opened, so there are only two people ahead of us. Iris fills out the deposit slip, and I stand in line with Wes right behind me. The line moves as Iris walks over with the slip, taking the envelope from me and tucking it into her purse. She looks warily at Wes, then at me. I bite my lip. Just a few more minutes. Iris sighs. Look, she says to Wes, propping her hands on her hips. I understand that the way you found out wasn't great, but... That's when Iris is interrupted. But not by Wes. No, Iris gets interrupted by the guy in front of us. Because the guy in front of us? He chooses that moment to pull out a gun and start robbing the freaking bank. The first thing I think is, shit. The second thing I think is, get down. And the third thing I think is, we're all gonna die because I waited for the bacon donuts.